morning, you two. So, the last series of videos is cam failure. This is a little weird. I pulled the valve cover. First of all, listen for the tech. Very, very subtle. Nowhere near as loud as it was. Let me shut this off. So. I got up this morning. It's Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to all you fathers. Um, and I pulled the valve cover off. Uh, I posted a short video of what it looked like in there. Jay's hard push, hard and push rods, they're fine. The RPM pack, uh, 12 springs, they're fine. I started it, as you can see, still cleaning up all the oil. Um, I started it up. All the springs went up and down fine. They all looked to be at the same area. I thought I recorded it, but I must not have. And I put it all back together, and I'm not going to take it apart again to record it. But I didn't see any signs of cam or lifter failure from watching it run. Everything seemed to be going the same. Heights up and down, nothing stuck out. Um, all the videos I see of them, they pretty much stick out pretty good. Um, and now the ticking, it's not completely gone, but it's a lot quieter. Um, I don't know what's going on in here. We're still going to do a cam change. I want to see what's going on. But I'm not as concerned. Um... I'll reach out and talk to Mark, see what he has to say about it, but I more hear the ticking now through the exhaust on underneath the vehicle instead of, or underneath the truck, instead of in the engine compartment. So if anyone knows what that means, throw it in a comment, I'd appreciate it. So happy Father's Day. Um... I'm going to go run my wife around today. Maybe we'll make a few different videos on a couple things that got on my mind. And you guys like and subscribe.